Hey kids, Brian Trowman here, Pez Through the Ages. We got a Facebook page, a YouTube channel, and the Moshi Monsters set. This comes out in 2012, but uh, John Lespin has got it in his guide for 2013. The Pez website says 2012. Uh, I don't know. Down they go. And the manufacturing date here on the bottom is 12, but we all know that doesn't really mean much of anything. It may be 2013. I got mine in April of 2013 from Mario uh, Stapik in Slovenia. So I don't know, your situations may vary. Moshi Monsters was an online game where you adopt a pet and you can raise it. I guess it's kind of like the Tamagotchi from the, I don't know, what was that, 90s, 2000s? I don't know, some time waster of um, electronics. Also, a, a mind waster from Mind Candy Limited. That's the company that owns the trademark, I suppose, the, the rights to this thing. What we have here is brown thing called Furry, F-U-R-I. We have this orange jackal of a thing called Katsuma. And we have this pink, uh, I don't know, a pig? Nah, the nose would be different. I don't know what this is. It's called Poppet. P-O-P-P-E-T. I really don't understand it. But the point is, if you want all three of them, if you want a complete Pez collection, or at least try, you got to have these. They're all on a 7.5 stem. This first one is China, and China comes with a 6 IMC, or injection molding code, on the other side. And it has, the inner sleeve has these two little circles right there by my thumbnail. Uh, Katsuma and Poppet, on the other hand, are on a 7, at least mine, are on a 7.5 made in Hungary. Hungary centered, not justified to the margin. Some people collect like that. And um, and mine have smooth inner sleeves, no circles right below it. Also says mind candy, or is it brain candy? No, it's mind candy. So uh, we've got a 7.5 China, two 7.5 Hungary's. These are worth four to five bucks a piece, so 12 to 15 for the set. Probably can find it a little bit less, I would suppose. But for something that's now a decade old, good luck finding it in the stores. You're going to find these in antique stores, despite them not really being antiques. Find them on Facebook. Uh, find them on eBay. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.